my friends are still talking about drugs Saying feels like heaven come and feel like us No, am I supposed to go? Yep. <laughs> Sorry, I had to go Well, it's our afternoon hunt this morning We only saw one little button back here was the only one that was like in shooting range. Uh, we saw a seven point out in the woods. Or out in the fields. Uh, pretty far away. Didn't come into us at all. And then we had two does that snuck up on us, but couldn't get anything off at them. Hopefully we'll see something in night. Nice.
viewers want to hear what you're feeling. I don't know. You just got the ultimate experience of bow hunting. Ups and downs. <laughs> Starting with the downs. The shot was a little far back. Um, we're going to give her some time. But she was hurting. She's going to bed down right down there. I think we're going to be in good shape, honey. What do you think? What are you feeling? I don't know. You don't know? Kind of mad. You, are you mad? Are you upset? Are you happy that you just shot a deer? Your first Both. deer? Oh. You just shot your first deer? Yeah. It's probably one of the ones I hit before with my car, but... <laughs> <laughs> Cheer up a little bit. You just shot your first deer with a bow. After I missed it? Yeah, but you shot it. You still shot it. Missing is part of the game. Proud of you. You worked hard this whole summer. Good job, honey. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna slowly and quietly back up. I'm shaking more than Chrissy is right now. We're gonna get our first arrow. And we're gonna go back to the house, straight back. And uh, get the lights charging. I can't even talk right now. <laughs> I didn't even shoot the deer. And uh, we're gonna give it quite a bit of time. We might come back and check for first blood, but we might end up waiting until tomorrow morning. I'm not sure, we gotta look at it on the big screen, see what we're at exactly. Deer's gonna die. Just depends how long it's gonna take. So we'll check back in with you when we look over the footage. Well, we're going over the footage and uh, she definitely hit it a little ways back. Um, she's definitely gonna die. Uh, it's just, I think it's gonna take a while. We're gonna have to wait minimum four or five hours. Here's a quick clip of it. Right there's impact. So the deer's definitely gonna die, and I'm pretty sure she bedded right right as she ran out of sight. Um, so if we wait the right amount of time, she should be dead right there. Uh, we got our fingers crossed. We're gonna go have some dinner and see what some other people think and go from there. Closer. All right, well, we're out. We're going to look for her deer. Um, it's been five, six hours now. I wanted to wait longer, but we've been having a lot of coyotes around here, and I don't want the coyotes to beat us to it. Um, I think she bedded down within like 80 to 100 yards, so I think she'll be dead right there, hopefully. Um, we're just going to shine the field, and if she's not right there, we're going to back out till morning. We're going to be real quiet when we do it, too, so you won't see much of us. She didn't go anywhere. Got her. I can't see anything. You're so not supposed to be able to see. You just gotta keep going. Right to her. They were a poke on the coyotes have already gotten to her. Nice job, honey. She was dead yeah. as soon as we left. Nice job, baby. Coyotes got it. What do you think? What do you think? Well, she... <laughs> We were all worried. I mean, the shot was a little far back, but she definitely got something vital because uh, we're 65 yards from the stand and she's stiffer than a board. She was dead within 
a minute and a half probably. Um, like I said before, is we come in early because we didn't want the coyotes to get it, and the coyotes actually were already on it when we got out here. The tail's eating off. Um, you know, you get them them gut hits. She did get some of the guts, and the the smell goes for miles. And the coyotes come in from somewhere, but deer was dead within 30 seconds. Chrissy's first deer ever. Um, obviously, first with a bow, and she experienced all the highs and lows of bow hunting in one sit. You know, she missed it at 15 yards, it happens, and it, luckily we got a second chance at it, and it came back in pretty perfect, and she made a pretty good shot on it, and did the job, and now we're going to eat pretty good for a while. Are you hooked on bow hunting now? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Can we at least get a little bit of a smile for the camera? <laughs> so we're going to get her tagged up, take her back, and get her, get her cleaned up, and off to the butcher tomorrow for some sausage sticks. Give her a kiss. <laughs> you should put the deer up the other. Getting ready to close out the story on Chrissy's deer. Got her at the butcher right now. Just waiting on them to get here. And Get it all loaded out into their shop. Uh, Tall Pines Deer Processing. Uh, my buddy started that, I think it was a year or two ago. And they do pretty good work. This is the first time I've brought one here, but I know a lot of people who have. They've normally got a pretty fast turnaround. They'll make pretty much whatever you want. So, yep, we're gonna get her unloaded, get a bunch of bacon burger made up, maybe some sausage sticks. We'll see what happens. It's like it's real, but I can't be sure. Now my eyes are blind.